Welcome to Mac 3D. Engineering mechanics is defined as the science, that describes and predicts the conditions of rest or motion of bodies, under the action of forces. It consists of the mechanics of rigid bodies, mechanics of deformable bodies, and mechanics of fluids. The mechanics of rigid bodies, is subdivided into statics and dynamics. Statics deals with bodies at rest, and dynamics deals with bodies in motion. In this lecture series, we are going to cover the following topics. Introduction of forces in plane. Equilibrium of a particle, in 2D. Forces in space. Equilibrium of a particle, in 3D. Vector product, and application. Scalar product, and applications. Couples. Equivalence system. Rigid body equilibrium, in 2D. Two and three force members. Rigid body equilibrium, in 3D. Trusses, method of joints. Trusses, method of sections. Frames, machines. Dry friction. Wedges and belts. Centroid, composite plates. Distributed loads, centroid of a volume. Moment of inertia. Parallel axis theorem. As we know that, in static, we deal with bodies at rest. So the sum of forces must be equal to zero. Now, consider a picture frame hanging on a wall. If this picture frame is in equilibrium, its mean sum of all the forces acting on this frame is zero. It is pretty clear, that we are going to discuss forces in detail. Force is a vector quantity. It has magnitude and direction. Vectors can be represented in two ways. Symbolic representation and graphical representation. Graphically, a vector is represented by an arrow. Length of the arrow represents its magnitude, and the head points the direction. For example, in the case of force, the head points in the direction of applied force. In statics, we have to add different forces to calculate our result. So first of all, we will discuss vector addition. There is two methods for vector addition. Using sine and cosine rule. Vector addition by rectangular components. Thanks for watching this video. We will continue this lecture in the next video. If you like this video, please, like, comment, and subscribe.